Accompanied by his family, Robert E. Hannigan, chairman of the Democratic National Committee, is sworn in at Washington as Postmaster General of the United States by Associate Justice Wiley Rutledge of the Supreme Court. Hannigan is one of the five new cabinet appointees made by President Truman since taking office. Another, Tom C. Clark of Texas, former assistant to Francis Biddle, is sworn in as Attorney General. He receives the oath from Judge Thurman Arnold while his proud family stands by. Sworn in by Judge Sherman Minton, Louis B. Schwellenbach succeeds Francis Perkins as Secretary of Labor. The new secretary was formerly senator from the state of Washington, and later a federal judge appointed by President Roosevelt. The new Secretary of Agriculture, Clinton P. Anderson, is sworn in by Judge Rutledge and congratulated by Judge Vinson. Mr. Anderson was previously representative from New Mexico. In addition to agriculture, he will also take over the functions of the former War of Food Administration.